sorry guys, I cut off from the last video because I got an alert on my phone. It was an amber alert in my city. But, so, like I was saying, she starts beating her. And then, like, there's a bunch of kids on the soccer field. Like, there's a track around the soccer field. And it's where people run, people sit, like, stuff like that. And then, they start absolutely, they start running around the playground, around the recess yard, telling people about this massive fight that's breaking out. And so, I'm like, whoa, this is crazy. Because someone comes up to me, and they start telling us about it. And then I, being the person that I am, I run. I, I literally am out of breath to this point because I've been running so far. So, like, imagine this is the track. All the way over there is the playground and the um, swings, all that stuff. Actually, the swings are quite close. Then there's, like, a tree, a couple trees as barriers. And so I book it to go see this. And then I see, like, the queen blonde crouched up in a fetal position, crying. Because she obviously got beat up. And so... Everyone. Because everyone doesn't like her. But th my friend was the first person to stand up to her because she's a year older. She's the oldest person in fifth grade. And so then we all run over and everyone's like asking, can I sign your autograph? Can you give me a high five? Can I know um, how you did it? And she sits with me at lunch. So I kept asking these questions. But I'm going to get back to the recess. So then we're all like a bunch of kids. There's about 55 or so kids. I don't know the percentage but about a third of the fifth grade comes over to this girl and her two other friends that she was hanging with while this was happening. And they're all like, you did a great job. You are amazing. How can I be like you? Stuff, stuff like that. And then I give her a high five because she's been my friend since kindergarten. So... They both get taken to the office, and so does another kid. He wasn't involved in the fight. Let's call him Ginger. He also goes to the office because he was, um, I don't know. It was something weird. He's just one of those kids who usually gets in trouble a lot. But then he... We're all like, that's crazy. She did the right thing because no one likes this girl. Like, literally no one likes her. And she's just a massive butthole to everyone who treats her wrong because she used me as a turncoat. Like, she used to get hella bur bullied um, back in third grade when she moved because no one liked her because... She wasn't like this, but she was, like, um, technically, like, a whiner. Not really, but I was her friend because I actually felt bad for this little, for this little spoiled brat. I can't believe I felt bad for her, but I just so happened to feel bad because, I'm empathetic for people, I'm sympathetic for people, on and on, and I just got so mad because 
she started using me as a turncoat because I was her only friend because 